All right, in Fox Family and Health, from stomach aches to sunburns, natural home remedies to help you feel better without the chemicals. Kim Olson, Fit Kim, is here this morning to talk more about how you can take care of it. I like this idea because a lot of times people are at home and say they've heard about that you can use other things outside of just taking a medicine for something that mm -hmm. ails you, right? Right, and a lot of times they don't know where to start is what I find. So okay. you'll see these these are very simple things you can do, but to start with, I think this is a great place that anyone can handle, and these are my must-haves. Okay, let's <laughs> start right here then. So whenever somebody has an upset stomach and it can be for say we overate or something isn't agreeing with us, sure. there are different natural things you can do. Um, this one right here is called Garcinia Cambogia. Have you heard of it? I have it's been, because of you. It's very <laughs> you remember. Yes. yes. So it has many different things that it can do but as far as stomach and it can actually help you feel full if you remember to take it 30 uh -huh. minutes before meals with about eight ounces of water. Okay. This is called uh, Genesis today. You can get it at HEB. Okay. So that can kind of help you feel full quicker. Ginger is my favorite thing to go to when people have um, Acid reflux, yes. heartburn. I use yes. ginger when I fly too because I get motion sickness. So in the car, so ginger things. helps me too. Yeah. How yeah. do you use it? What form? I use it like in a pill form. Okay, yeah, yeah there's, you can do anything like that. A pill, you can do tea. It can help with also food poisoning. Yo, okay, that's a good <laughs> thing to know. You want something right yeah, away. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and peppermint oil, we all think of it as calming. Oh. So it can help with nausea, any kind of digestive illness. I love to incorporate peppermint. Okay, very nice. Okay, what's here? This the fiber. For, okay. You know right away what we're going to <laughs> irregularity. And this is something where people will take anything to fix it. Yes. So this is some natural safe things to do. The first one's flaxseed oil. Okay. Loaded with omega-3s. And what they do is they lubricate the digestive system. So mm. you can see how that can help it be easier to have a bowel movement. Could you do flax seeds too? Yes. Okay. So so, okay. I, I like to rotate them. Um, this can be a great starter for people because it is lubricating. It's probably easier and you yeah. can put it in a smoothie or you can yeah. put it in things yes. too. Okay. And then also this right here is called Gen Essentials Fiber. You can get it at Whole Foods Central Market. And okay. it's actually seven grams of fiber. So okay. you know that's going to help promote overall colon health and regularity. But it has a certain herbal blend in it that actually targets every part of the digestive tract. So Ooh. it can just help you to be consistently Yeah, regular. and move you along. Yes. Yes. Now <laughs> this one is kind of a... Nature's, it's called Nature's Relief by okay. Pure Health, so it's when you need a little extra something. So it's not habit forming, but you can just do a tea, uh, one tea uh, before you go to bed. Okay, and I think for women, we really deal with that a lot of times, and we right. go, how can we get some relief? So those are good That's ways of doing of, it. That's kind of a natural way to do it. Okay. This is our anti-itch options. Uh, the first thing is obviously baking soda. Okay. I'm always talking about how great yeah. it is, but you can actually use it for when you have an itch. So it can help take the sting out of bites, um, and actually it really is calming to the skin so what you do is make a little paste out of it okay and literally it and also kind of does some cleansing there too does this help with sunburns is that one of those things yeah I have some other things oh, as okay. well but a lot of times they cross-reference so if you don't have one of them try one of these options too okay um, Epsom salts again used for many different things take one cup and put it in your bath water and it actually is antibacterial as well as it promotes healing okay and Kim we're gonna wrap up they're actually telling us it's going okay. a little quicker yeah. so I just don't want to run out of time no, for no the sunburn because so we mentioned sunburn, it. we all know aloe vera obviously um, cayenne pepper is great for scrapes and cuts and things like that. And lavender oil can be soothing. And then this is for sleep options. So this is called Relax Me. Take it before you go to bed. It's oh, Genesis. Yeah, yes. Ernie was looking you at this. You can get that at HEB. It's in the refrigerator section. It has uh, ingredients to help with calming. And then Sleep Sweetly is my magic bullet. It's non-habit forming. Okay. And that's by Pure Health. And you can get that at Walmart. Very nice. And they yeah. also make those um, green coffee beans too, that same brand. Yes, does. absolutely. See, I recognize. I'm getting well. better every you time you come by. <laughs> All right. Uh, Ernie, yes, here. You can take this too. All right, we Fit Kim, you too. can go to her blog, fitkim.com. She also has a Facebook page so you can find out even more yes. information. Great tips, Kim. Thanks Thank for you for being me. here. And we'll be back after a break right here on Fox News First. Ernie, no more. Come on, bring it back. <laughs> I didn't take anything. <laughs>